I want to reply to a comment on the video where I combined the Moza Aircraft 3 gimbal with the Moza Slidepod Pro motorized slider. Would that setup work if you had filmed using your Canon RF 24-70 f2.8 lens on your camera? I have that same heavy lens, wondering if the setup would support it. Hey, thanks for the question, Bruce. Let's find out. So first of all, I needed to check if this 900 grams heavier lens from Canon can be mounted on the Aircraft 3 gimbal. What's the benefit of having a good gimbal if you can't use heavier zoom lenses? Because not everyone wants to use prime lenses, which of course uh, are lighter sometimes, but with those you are limited to a fixed focal length. So keep in mind that the Aircraft 3 gimbal supports up to 3.2 kilograms and the total weight of the camera body the lens and the base plate of the gimbal has a total of 1.6 kilograms. So it should work, right? Well, let's find out. You see, the camera body weighs 660 grams, so the whole setup becomes front heavy. It has the tendency to lean forward. No matter how hard you try to position the camera at the back of the base plate, it will still lean forward while it's mounted on the gimbal. So is there a solution for this? Yes, it is, but some of you may consider that it's not the safest one. But at least for me, it's 100% safe. This is my opinion. When you mount the base plate on the gimbal, at some point you'll hear a click. That's the safety mechanism if you forget to lock the base plate using the lever. This lever is really strong and I personally trust it 100%. And with that in mind, you can bypass the locking mechanism by pressing here and now the base plate can be pushed more to the back of the gimbal to this position. And then use the lever to lock it in place. And of course, you'll need to adjust all the axes with patience, but the good thing is that it's possible to end up with a very good result and balance of a Canon EOS R with the RF 24-70 f2.8 lens on the Moza Aircraft 3 gimbal. And yes, you can still use the 2.9 kg setup on the Slypod Pro motorized slider because it accepts maximum payloads of 3.5 kg in horizontal mode, so you shouldn't have any problems with this. This is the next video you should watch because I talk about the Aircraft 3 gimbal and the Slypod Pro slider, so you'll see how this combo works. Bruce, thanks for the comment. I hope this video helped you. I'm Christy and see you guys in the next video.